Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to change the position of a raster. Now, as you can see that I have already loaded the DEM and first of all, I am going to check the existing position of this raster DEM. To do that, you can simply right click on this, go to properties and over here under the special references you can see that it's already defined into wgs 1984 geography coordinate system so for this tutorial i am going to change the position from a geography coordinate system into a positive coordinate system now the tool that you can use is found in your toolbox under the management tool for changing the position system for this go to catalog menu then click on system toolboxes go to data management tools after that go to projections and transformations click on plus sign and if you expand this just option you can see that this one is an option called project master so you can simply double click on that and as your input raster you can use your current raster of dm insert srtmgl when you drag it and drop it over here you will be able to see your current existing coordinate system the existing coordinate system over here is gcs wgs1984 now over here you have the option to define the output coordinate system so in this case i am going to go to position coordinate system click on plus sign of project coordinate system under utm wgs1984 northern hemisphere and then click on wgs1984 utm then 46 north then click on ok here i have selected wgs 1984 utm 46 north because of this dm is corresponding to a part of asia and over here you can define your path to save the new positive raster so i am saving this new positive raster on my desired location i am creating a folder over here so click on desktop and here you can see output cell size actually if you want to change the grid cell size of the raster you can also do that at the same time click on same as layer system diff and you have been see that uh, this is the output cell size over here so i am keeping it is as existing cell size so simply i am click on ok the process is going over here and it will take some time now i am changing the color rom of this positive coordinate system now you can see that we already have the positive raster so just to be sure i am going to go to properties of this raster click on properties and click on sources now i am going to check the special references and you have to see that we have successfully reproductive the raster DM from WGS 1984 geography coordinate system into WGS 1984 ATM46. Okay. So that's about it for this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. And if you would like to see more interesting of this tutorial, I recommend it to you. Please subscribe my channel. Thank you and have a good day.